and the bay a canemo nozo and no boss say a wood chitata bookwa a banning cage and about twenty three of October twenty twenty three. A tata bobo say a banadia born at Tonkoma October. No nibo. I send the bay no gadi catch in the child of Guago. A try pro to acquire the reading. Yes, yes, yes. Um, if I be Eastern News, guys, no tell you no, Ozia do a camp, but can I find one quite well? No, I can have one banana drop on up the job, not be for Nepomaki and even a Nebo and the whole Eastern region. I can get it in the update on Eastern News 24. So, Ugunu Jaibo in our comment, you na any update job na ITL, Nirakuka, and share where you can do where so called Megan where comment here on it. Uh, Ozia will tell you, Nikita, over the year. A Biaflam Prime Minister, man, someone at Bakudu was Tamak and Debo and the Ndibo game. And look, the name Yabu audio. Sing you know, you will call Bon and Debo, you may be fair. So, in second year, you may be fair, couldn't get where you can say on a drop or comment on Bastara. If you know, Chelo, me Biaflam Prime Minister, advice in Debo, Famer, me Bakuka. All right, over to you. For you, when Biafra finally come. And I'm very, very sure, very, very optimistic that Biafra is coming. And I'm going to tell you a little bit, give you a little bit of hint how this Biafra will come. I want you to remember that from the beginning, you have always doubted me. When we started the Biafra Republic government, you doubted me. At the end, you see cabinet, over 113 people. When we started the Biafra administrative office in the United States, in Baltimore, you doubted me. Some people even went there to remove the Biafra flag. They say nothing like that existed. It's a lie. It's a propaganda. Yet, it came... We inaugurated the house and you become a liar as always. You failed. I am still here. We started the Biafra self-referendum convention in Finland, started advertising it. They say it's a propaganda. It is only way to collect money from his unsuspecting members. As if that is not enough. They saw people trooping in into Finland. They say that is not true. They saw the way I entered the hall. The love showered on me is, is unbelievable. And then they begin to panic. They say, oh, the people that came to Finland are idiots. The people that came to Finland are not human beings. The people that came to Finland don't have sense. Of course, you know, they always look for something to talk you down. But we have never deviated one day. We never shaked. We talked about the Biafra Liberation Army. They say it's a lie. He don't have anybody. There is no man anywhere. You only have this boys brigade. Some people even begin to compare the Eastern Security Network picture videos with just a show of the anti-aircraft that we have. One of the anti-aircraft. They say, oh, they are just four. Today, they have seen battalion. And they have gone to the abyss. I want you to understand that there is nothing I have said that did not come to pass. The only thing remaining is the declaration of Biafra. I am giving you these instances so that for you who are in a better position to fund this liberation, to support the liberation, and you are staying behind the scene and castigating what we're doing, believe me, the consequences is heavy. I want you to understand that in South Korea, those who did not support their freedom are not citizens. You renew your residence permit every year. We are going to have something tougher than that. You see all of you in the U.S., all of you in America, all of you in Biafra land, 
believe me, you are going to see law that will bend your mouth. Now, we have been able to inaugurate and unveil the Biafra Liberation Army and all forces of Biafra. And the idea is to make sure we arm them to the teeth. The time we complain about the killings by the Nigeria Terrorist Army Police, DSS, is over. Completely over. We can never complain again. So it is gone for gone. Bullet for bullet. Bomb for bomb. Until you leave our land and go back to Nigeria. Those who think that we are going to keep silent when we are being butchered and killed, I'm sorry to disappoint you. I will fight even when I am not breathing. I will continue to fight. But let me tell you, you will not have the opportunity to make me not to breathe. I will destroy the entity called Nigeria as fast as possible. The destruction of Nigeria is to safeguard the Afra people. The destruction of the evil entity, a terrorist entity called Nigeria, is for self-defense of the Biafra people. Women and children who have paid the ultimate price by sacrificing many millions of Biafrans for the past years. The difference here is when those people were being sacrificed for one Nigeria, this strategy was a failure. The strategy that led to the sacrifice of many millions of Biafra was a failure. Today, we know better. Nigeria will die silently until Biafra will rise and rise and the flag will go up and rise among nations. They say we are in the bushes. They thought propaganda can win a war. Propaganda can never win war. For us to be able to get to this level, we have defeated Nigeria, neutralized them, delegitimized them, and we are going to do this from village to village, from town to town, from city to city, until Biafra land is completely captured. This is Biafra Army. Biafra resist resistance fighters in the street of Biafra land. After their parade, why they will tell you, oh, the Nigeria army have done this and done that. You know when I tell you people how we neutralize them, they thought we are joking. Let them come here. This is completely under the control of Biafra army. And more are coming. <laughs> And you know, the next thing, some of them say, oh, they don't have weapons. They don't have weapons. They do not have weapons. There's only few people have weapons. The same people will not be talking about how we, re how we resist and repel the terrorists in uniform each time they come. We don't repel them with ordinary hand. We repel them with the same equal measures of firepower. And you don't tell us what to do. We don't display our arms. What I did last time was to show them 
that we can actually say no fly zone and we can enforce it. I said after Finland convention, things will never remain the same. And from tomorrow, things will never remain the same. We are now back to full liberation of Biafra. We now have a government, we now have two governments. We have the government in the homeland and we have the exile government. Those of you who have been appointed to head the government of the de facto in the homeland, you will be communicated internally on what and how this is done. This evening, I am informing Biafra people that the de facto government will tax every Biafran and the tax is called the Biafra Liberation Tax. That the Biafra Liberation Tax is a tax that will be imposed by the Biafra de facto government in the homeland. And this tax will be used to buy weapons that we use to protect our land and defend ourselves against internal external aggression aggression biafra will be the only nation that will defend itself aggressively within nigeria until the declaration of biafra because we want to put every culpability where culpability is and run a transparent government. You will be hearing from time to time instructions and directive, especially on the issue of finance. The Biafra de facto government has a receipt. War, defense, security requires fund requires money and if you make yourself available to be used by the enemy in order to demoralize our people you are also going to be a victim of insecurity if out of hatred jealousy greed you fight against your own security. You will become a victim of insecurity. I want to briefly tell you how Biafra is going to come. At this point, we have over 100,000 personnel of the Biafra Liberation Army and the Biafra Resistance Fighters across Biafra land. Our aim is to make sure that we have every sophisticated weapon needed to defend our land. And the delegitimization of Nigeria have started, as you all know, within Biafra land. We we'll delegitimize Nigeria until the last person remaining. What I mean the last person is that we we'll delegitimize local government, we we'll delegitimize state government delegitimized the federal presence in Biafra land and then after that we are going to organize our self referendum before we go to the point of organizing self referendum the world will talk and shout about Biafra hey, Darukwan Linne no kuni si wene se la ni ya ne me na Easter News 24. I see the no ya drun nama neke drun nama nolia kuzero nama na fo kuzero nama na fo unza ya anon kendi bo juwe bili I see no ya drun ne nama ocho ya kuri ocho ko ya drun isa 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 um di ko si de una nugo no kaya bifes we bata we kuro ifun no ni no akupo kifu wele kiku basta makaya 
bia flam prime minister kugasini wa kukwa eh gini kiwele kikumba gini kiwele kiku basta makea eh drop a like wa comment on the commission bureau eh chef kwa eastern news 24 kaisi ni wotele nukozi ya do kemba dalo numune mungwan kemesean